What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to, my, new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading. Cups of side to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, apply, everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Um, free general collective reading. Love you guys so much. We're at 12,755 subscribers right now. So thanks so much for all the love and support to the channel. I truly appreciate it. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess Profile. The link's in the search box below. PayPal only. No cash up, no Venmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate if you choose to donate. Okay, so I received a channel message in, so I'm going to deliver it. Hope everybody is doing fantastical. Um, the channel message I received was... <clears throat> Someone who tried to make someone who tried to make um, the goat out to be the scapegoat um, is about to be set up soon. Is what I heard. So you plug it in how it resonates. Someone who tried to make the um, goat out to be goat out to be the scapegoat is about to be set up. Now anybody doesn't know the goat G O A T is the greatest of all time. So someone who tried to make goat-like energy, greatest of all time, S-type energy, out to be the scapegoat. So they tried to make the goat like the scapegoat, uh, like it was their fault, like setting them up. But their ass is about to be set up, is what it sounds like, in my opinion, from channel message. Um, and honestly, they freaking ain't deserve it. They should have never tried to do that shit, and that's just the truth. So you plug in, however that resonates, if that resonates for you. So someone who tried to make... Um, the goat out to meet the scapegoat, their ass about to be set up now. A plan has already been uh, has already been formulated. A plan has already been formulated is what I just heard. So you plug it in how it resonates, man. So somebody's already um, getting a plan together or they've already got a plan um, planned out to basically set up this um, person that tried to set up the goat. Um, whoever this is and Howard applies. Spirit messages you have reflected. They should have left well alone, alone, but they chose to keep picking and picking and picking. Okay, I heard they should have left well alone, but they uh, just kept picking and picking and picking. So whoever this um, set up person that tried to set up a goat-like energy, greatest of all time type S energy, um, they should have left well alone with this person, uh, but they didn't. I heard they just kept picking, 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 so they kept antagonizing this person or kept bullying this person or kept harassing this person or kept doing something very negatively to this person either to their face behind their back or both how would that resonate holy shit man spirit messages you have reflected it is about to be on holy shit i heard that big i heard it's about to be on man Beginnings. Uh, I think this is the plan that's already being, um, it sounds like it's already in the universe. It sounds like the plan's already in the universe. Um, now, whether it's fully planned out and about to be enacted or is being enacted now in the universe, I'm not sure, but there is a plan definitely already in the universe, I can tell you that, um, to, for, um, it sounds like behind the scenes for this set up person and they're not going to like it um and i'm just being broke real so we have beginnings number hold on y'all number two yeah two two could be a very significant number in one's life number two it could be a possible age of a child of yours or somebody you're connected to or any other kind of significant number in one's life number two beginnings This person is shooting themselves in the foot energetically right now in the universe. They keep talking about the goat and talking about the goat and talking about the goat. 
cannot keep this person's name out of their mouth. It's about to seriously backfire on their ass. Okay. I heard, um, so this person that tried to set the goat up, um, the greatest of all time as type energy. It can be a masculine or femme goat energy. You plug this person in, how they resonate, but uh, to you. But I heard they keep, they're shooting themselves in the foot energetically. So not metaphorically. They're not, I mean, not literally. They're not literally with the gun out there shooting themselves in the foot. Um, they're, it's metaphorical, shooting themselves in the foot. They're talking about the goat. I heard they just keep talking about this person. They're talking about, I'm talking about. So the goat, whoever this goat S type energy is to this person, um, mass, uh, feminine to feminine energy, sorry, feminine, feminine, femme to femme energy. So femme to femme energy. So it's a femme to femme energy. So it's a femme energy talking about another femme energy. She, she just keeps having her name in her mouth, having her name in her mouth, having her name in her mouth, having her name in her mouth. It's just, she, it's like, like a disease to her. She just keeps talking about her ass, but in a negative way and not in a positive way. Um, she can't stand her. She's jealous of her is what I'm presuming. She's jealous of her ass. She can't, and she can't stand her because of jealousy, um, and envy and other reasons. So she just keeps negatively gossiping about her ass. But I heard it's about to backfire on her. I think in the form of this plan. So I was like, I don't know how many people's formulating this plan in the universe. I didn't hear that. So probably several people. But it sounds like the gossip is about to energetically backfire on her, on her ass. Boomerang back energetically on her. And this plan is about to get her ass is what it sounds like. Whatever this plan is. I didn't hear any specifics on it. So beginnings, beginnings with um, this plan. It sounds like it's about to come in, uh, come into interaction soon here. Let me see if I hear anything else. Lots of new beginnings are about to begin here. Soon, through many series of chain of events, this this feminine goat energy will not even be anywhere around this other feminine energy. It's about to piss her off in a huge way. Okay, I heard many new beginnings are about to take place here soon. This fem energy, goat S type energy, is not even going to be around this other crazy um, gossipy gale S type fem energy. Um, she's not going to. It sounds like be anywhere near her energetically. Um, so she's talking all this shit about her, talking all this smack about her, just talk, talk, talking negatively, negative Nancy energy about her, but soon she's not even going to be around the energetic space around her ass. So it's going to be new beginnings created for, um, the fem energy, goat S type energy, um, and new beginnings for the negative Nancy S fem energy too. Uh, for some of these, uh, negative Nancy fem S type energies, they could be doppelgangers of them. I didn't hear they were, but I've been picking up strong femme doppelganger energy here recently, again, in the energetic space, like really strong femme doppelganger energy. So, and these are femme to femme energy. So for some, they could be doppelgangers of this femme goat, some maybe not. You plug it in how it resonates, but the femme goat is not even going to be anywhere around this other femme energy, whether she's a doppelganger of this chickadoo or not, uh, because of the plan. Um, soon, you plug it in how it resonates. Protection, yeah, we have beginnings and protection. Number 24 could be a very significant number of one's life too. Number 24 could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible date of birth number, possible green card number, any other significant number of one's life, two and 24. Protection. This feminine energy gossiper is trying to make it out like the feminine goat is uh, very malicious and hateful and mean, but everybody knows she's not. 
It's about to seriously backfire on her in a huge ass way. The fem goat is about to get a huge, huge, huge positive things happen to her soon. Haters gonna hate. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Wow. So um, this negative Nancy fem energy um, energy basically is the hate on her ass. She just keeps hating, 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 hating. Gossip, 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 gossip. Talk and talk and talk and shit. Talk and talk and talk and shit. Lots of, lots of, lots of, lots of. But how that resonates, um, it's about to backfire on her in many ways. I mean, just for real, there's a plan set in place here. Um, whether it's already enacted or not in the universe, I'm not sure. I'm not feeling for a lot of these situations it has yet. I feel it's beginning stages for um, some of these. But um, how it resonates, um, the fem goat i heard is about to get a lot of help soon a lot of help and support and um it sounds like help and support to get out of the area of this crazy ass feminine energy gossipy gale i heard she's trying to make people out like the fem goat is a mean aggressive um person um but i heard everybody knows she's not um and it's about to seriously backfire on her meaning i think one of the ways it's going to backfire on her is people aren't going to start believing a damn word coming out of her mouth when everything she's saying is a damn lie. I mean, who the hell wants to believe a liar? Nobody. And that's just the damn truth. I mean, if the femme goat is keeping to herself, chilling, chillaxing, doing, you know, just keeping to herself, staying in her lane, doing what she needs to do, taking care of her own, um, then obviously there's no signs of aggression or meanness or um blasey 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 coming out of her how the hell can people believe the other chickadoo i sure as hell wouldn't you know many 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 shocking series of chain events are about to occur soon many it's about to go very, very positively for this fem goat energy. Get her the way, the hell away from these crazy ass people. Okay, I heard basically a ton of mini series of chain events are about to um, occur for the fem goat S type energy. So the one, the other, we have two people in here: the fem goat and the negative Nancy femme energy that's basically shit talking her into the ground into her community and society and the world and etc um she's trying this one um i think she's mentally unstable i didn't hear she was but she sounds it i mean why would you want to believe anything that's coming out of her mouth when everything she's saying isn't true i sure as hell wouldn't and that's just the truth um i mean she's obviously a liar obviously obviously um, probably other things going on there. And I'm just being for real. And I hate to say that, but I'm just calling it how I see it. But how that resonates, um, I heard basically this, the Femme Goat's about to get a lot of help soon through basically many shocking series of, uh, series of chain events are about to occur soon to get this person some help to, or to get out of the, um, it sounds like to travel away. Um, physical distance away from the area, toxic area and community and um, that she's in because not just because of this person, but probably because of her whole community um, and a largely to do with this person too. So she's about to get protection. She's about to get protection and help and assistance is what I'm feeling here. Now, whatever the shocking series of chain events are, I'm not sure. Um, only, um, I'm not sure. I didn't hear that. So you plug it in how it resonates. And one person that strongly deals with this low vibrational feminine gossiper is about to get spiritually attacked soon. But they're about to realize it's because this low vibrational feminine energy does dark arts they're about to turn it around on her ass in a huge way jesus christ man you plug it in how it resonates okay so this this person does dark arts too um i don't feel the goat does i feel she probably is very high vibrational 
uh, she does her honey boo boo, stays in her lane, high vibrational. She might be a light side spiritualist for, uh, or reader or um, or et cetera, et cetera, et cetera for some of these people, possibly. But this one's not. She does dark arts and hoodoo and voodoo and whatever the hell else she does. But however that resonates, um, somebody connected to this person, the low vibrational gossipy gal over here, I heard is about to get spiritually attacked soon. Um, and once she gets spiritually attacked, the person that gets spiritually attacked, it's a masculine energy about to get spiritually attacked. Okay, I heard it's a masculine energy about to get spiritually attacked. So it's a masculine energy about to get spiritually attacked. Um, so you masculine energy, you're about to get spiritually attacked by her um, voodoo, hoodoo, witchcraft self, um, dark arts energy self. Um, and I heard once you do, you're about to turn it around on her. You're about to turn it around on her because you're about to realize it's her that did it to your ass. And you're very, very, very right. And you're very, very, very right. That's what I heard. And you're very right. So it's very right. You're very right. It's her that did it to your ass. And you're about to transmute the energy and turn it around on her, basically. Whoever this person is and how they apply. Um, this low vibrational gossipy girl as type energy. Um, she's definitely into hoodoo, voodoo, and dark arts and witchcraft. I'll tell you that. And I don't, I, I'm not talking about like light side witchcraft, like healing spells, protection spells, and blase, blase, blase. I mean, like, the dark shit, whoever she is. Dear God Almighty, man. All right, let me see if I hear anything else. The feminine energy goat is about to come, really, really become in her power once she is able to move away. Through many, 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 many series of chain events, this is about to occur. Many people are about to help make this happen very soon. Okay. Wow, this is beautiful. Okay, so I heard the Fem Energy Goat um, will really become in her power once she's able to move away. So, yeah, so moving is involved here. I was feeling it was earlier, but it's confirmation in the reading. Um, moving is involved here. Moving away from her toxic community, this toxic-ass, dark arts, chickadoo, and probably other people that interact with her and the toxic community. Um, but I heard she will really become in her power once she's able to move away. And through basically through a shit ton of series of chain events, it's about to happen for her. So she'll be able to be in her power, be able to be the goat again. Um, at one time she was the goat. She probably still, and I heard she still is the goat. It's just, I think she's a goat in a different way right now because she's got so many people out there, not only talking shit, talking about her, saying that she's this mean, aggressive, angry um person but also spiritually attacking her ass too with all this dark arts shit but if she's high vibrational which i feel she is it's returning to cinder automatically boomeranging back so um but i heard she'll really become in her power when she's able to physically move um locations and that that's fucking great so you plug in and how it resonates and a sagittarius feminine and a gemini masculine through many series of chain of events, are about to be in serious, serious, serious legal trouble. Serious. Federal level legal trouble. With Withheld information and was no help or protection. Through many series of chain of events, they're about to be served. Oh my God, you plug it in, how it resonates. This is crazy. Okay, so a Sag Fem and a Gemini Masculine. Apparently, they were no help to the fem goat. No help to her at all. Her, they were protection reverse. They did not help protect her. They did not help help her, period. Um, and I heard they're about to be in, through many series of chain events, they're about to be in, I heard, legal, heavy legal trouble on a federal level. And through many series of chain events, they're about to get communication regarding this shit. Um, because they didn't help protect her. They didn't help protect her. They were protection reverse. I think they were supposed to help protect her, but they didn't. Um... And so it sounds like they're about to start getting heavy legal communication soon through many series of chain of events. I think they're the people that are about to help the fem goat travel away is what I'm feeling. Um, but the, they're not protector energies. They're not, they're probably dark arts. They probably conspire with this crazy wackadoo is what I'm presuming. And I'm assuming this, uh, probably the Sag fem and the Gemini masculine, they probably communicate with this person, deal with this person. And so they automatically hate the fem goat too, is what I'm presuming. But 
you plug in and how it resonates. But I heard they're about to start getting heavy legal communication on a federal level. So it's not like state level, it's federal. Uh, and it is not going to go well for them at all, at all, at all. Heavy, 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 heavy legal issues. Okay, I heard it's not going to go well for them at all. Um, heavy, heavy, heavy legal issues. So they're about to, it sounds like these two are about to be in heavy legal issues soon. Gemini masculine and a Sag femme. They could have Gemini or Sag in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or Femme, and Haven, and Jupiter charts. Uh, I'm assuming adult energies. Gemini masculine, Sag femme. Um, you plug it in how it resonates, but it's about to create new beginnings for everybody. The goat is about to be able to move away. The femme goat's about to be able to move away. This chickadoo, so she, hopefully she gets some help, like some mental health treatment or some something. I, I, and I hate to say that, but you know, I believe in freedom of choice and freedom of making your own decisions. But this chickadoo, she, she, why does she keep having this chickadoo's name in her mouth? For negative reasons go heal and grow your own self this person doesn't know how to heal and manifest and grow their own self and that's just the truth and then these two they wasn't any damn help to this person and it sounds like they were supposed to or they said they were going to but they didn't um how that resonates so gemini masculine and a sagittarius feminine they could have gemini or sag in their sun moon rising venus ortho being hammered jupiter charts but new beginnings coming all across the board whether um, some of these new beginnings are positive some they're negative. You plug it in, how it resonates, and then the people about to help, about to help the goat. And that's going to create new beginnings too. Positive, healthy, copacetic uh, con connections and communications, but people outside of her toxic community is what I'm presuming coming up soon. Oh my God. Let me see if I hear anything else. Okay, I didn't. All right, you guys. Well, I love you guys so much. Everybody make wonderful choices and namaste.